Cancer is one of the biggest killers on this planet. Anyone who's lived through cancer therapy will understand the role it has in really damaging your body. At Quan Nutrition, where I practice, I'm Ryan Fernando, and it's always come to my core that what can we do about enhancing the nutrition to prevent cancer, enhance nutrition for people undergoing cancer therapy, and how do we change nutrition when somebody is in remission, that is, they've defeated cancer. So we've taken upon the mantle as one of the largest nutrition teams in the world to research cancer nutrition and get to the next level. As of this year in 2021, under my leadership, Qua Nutrition has launched the cancer treatment pro protocols for nutrition for our clients. Now you could reach out to us in different groups. I do know that one of my aunts had breast cancer. So all my cousins in my family are being requested to be screened for BRCA1 and BRCA2 gene, which is the breast cancer gene. We also do nutrition and health gene testing. I do significantly believe that your genetics give you a certain risk. A simple explanation would be your genes are like a gun. Your lifestyle is like a bullet. You put the bullet in the gun and then you pull the trigger. The trigger is your behavior. So a lot of times you may have the gene which is the gun, but if your lifestyle is correct, then it will not affect you in any way. So it's going to be how you base your nutrition on if you have a high risk of cancer. So please get in touch with us in case you feel that extended members of the elder part of your family have been exposed to cancer, then you as a next generation can take a precaution element by focusing on your nutrition. For those of you in cancer undergoing therapy, nutrition is really crucial during chemotherapy or any form of cancer treatment. During this period, your cells rely a lot on glucose to multiply. In fact, there's something known as the Warburg effect where cancer cells aggressively demand glucose to grow, the cancerous cells. If you can provide a right nutrition which stunts this process or denies this process, then you starve off the cancer cells from aggressively multiplying. In fact, controversial theories from doctors in the US on fasting during chemotherapy uh, is now the new norm. Now, does this work for you? I do not know. What works is getting a nutrition blood test done, getting a microbiome testing done. We actually have a cancer patient whose microbiome was checked before chemotherapy and then post chemotherapy. There was a drastic destruction of the good microbiome. Microbiome are the microorganisms inside your gut and these are the guys that ferment the food that you eat and transport the good healing molecules into your blood. So nutrition cannot cure cancer in my professional opinion but nutrition can definitely walk you through your chemotherapy or any radiation treatment that you do in a better fighting mode. Think of yourself as an Olympic level athlete and as an Olympic level athlete the battle for gold medal is to defeat cancer. During this period, if you eat the right foods in the right quantity at the right time and you know which foods are thumbs up for your body and you know which foods are thumbs down for your body, you give your body an excellent fighting chance to get out of this disease called cancer. And finally, if you defeat cancer and you go into remission, you're a warrior, you're a fighter. You need to rebuild your life. You need to rebuild your body. Do you know that the half-life of every cell in your body is of different duration? For example, your stomach cells are 11 days. Your hemoglobin is four months. Your hair is seven months. Your skin is around 16 to 20 weeks. Your fat cells is nine years. Your entire lungs is changed 10% every year, which means in a decade, you have a new set of lung cells. What am I trying to communicate to you? Your body is raw material in cancer risk 
in cancer therapy and in cancer remission. Reconstructing your body is a constant process. Why not feed your body the right raw materials to have a better health? Again, I repeat, there is no known diet that can cure cancer. But a combination of the right medical therapy, a sound mind, a strong mind, and the right nutrition plan for cancer can significantly improve your chances of having a happy, long, and healthy life. I wish you all the best. And if this video makes any sense to you, get in touch with us on our description link. Uh, have a call with one of our nutrition coordinators who will walk you through the discovery process. We will then fix an appointment for you to have a discovery call with one of our cancer specialist dietitians. And hopefully in that conversation, you will get a little bit of clarity on whether you want to pursue a nutrition program at Koan Nutrition. Once you do decide, sign up. What have you got to lose? You've got nothing to lose except those cancer cells out of you. God bless you.